it's 72 degrees out here. It's pretty warm, but it doesn't feel like 72 out. A little breezy. I don't know if we ever showed you this tree up here. See that tree? It had a bunch of uh, flowers on it. Look what they did. They're all over the ground. Right here. And it actually kind of goes up the stairs right here. Michelle uh, says it reminds her of like a really cute wedding or something, you know? Because when the wind was first blowing, it was blowing perfectly down the stairs and everything. See, look. Isn't it pretty? I think it's pretty. It does remind me of a little bit of like a wedding, you know? Like a fairy tale wedding. With pretty flowers everywhere. Michelle is at her uh, women's Bible study she goes to. And my hair is a mess, as always. I'm so excited to get a haircut. Guys, I'm getting a haircut in June. <laughs> I know you're like, why are you waiting until June? It's such a weird time to get a haircut. Why are you waiting until June? Blah, 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 blah. Well, uh, the person who does my hair, who does my hair, uh, actually um, doesn't start doing hair again. She took a little hiatus. She doesn't start doing hair again until June, so I have to make an appointment. And she really is the only person who can, who can do my hair, like, ugh, no one else is good enough. No, but seriously, I, I took, I went, me and Michelle and I went to a uh, hair salon, I think it's like, like, fine clips or whatever that's called. Um, we went, we went there and she was, she did a horrible job. Like, like, she didn't even like shave my neck, she didn't do anything. And she charged the same amount as this professional hair stylist did. So, we're like, you know what? We're just gonna wait. Uh, go to her when she reopens. I am a very weird person. Every morning I had this dilemma, not every morning, but the mornings that I wanna eat something. I have this dilemma about what I should eat in the morning because uh, ever since I was a little kid, whatever, no matter what it was that I ate, the first thing in the morning, the first thing in the day, even if it was at like 3.30 p.m. in the day, if it was the first thing I ate, I never ate a lot of it and it never tasted good to me. Uh, so it's, it kind of sucks because right now it's, it's, it's noon, right? Like, do I eat lunch or do I eat breakfast? And whatever I eat is, isn't going to taste really good. So like, I want chicken nuggets. But at the same time, I want them to taste good. So I kind of want to eat something that I don't really like, like a brand cereal or something. <laughs> uh, just so, uh, just so it, my chicken nuggets later will taste good. Uh, so I, I don't know if I'm going to uh, go ahead and eat chicken nuggets now or not. I don't think so. It, it must be this whole like my my tummy getting ready for uh, the day or something. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, honey. So how do you feel about your first day of the uh, new non-smartphones, or the stupid phones, if you will? Ha ha ha. <laughs> feel good. You feel good about it? feel free. It's nice to not have, I don't know, something that's always telling you what's happening on Facebook or Twitter, because it makes me care, and I don't really care, so. It makes her care, yet she doesn't really care. Yeah, so here is uh, her new phone. I think it's going to be good for us. It really will. My new phone is in my old phone that I used to use before. This is... <laughs> this is what? Huh? Huh? What? What? Where? What? How? Hmm? When? Hmm? Why? What? Hey guys, it's raining again. Awesome! It never rains in Ohio. <laughs> oh, and you know how we never got any uh, Easter candy or chocolate or anything for each other. Well, at the grocery store yesterday, we kind of got her own little special treat. And here is Michelle's treat. Mmm, you guys ever had these? Oh, they are so, so good! I would show you my treat, but I kind of already ate it. It was a big chocolate bunny. Typical Justin. Thanks, dear. It was like a seven or eight pound bunny. It was crazy big. Seven or eight pounds? Yeah. Maybe like seven or eight inches. Inches. Uh, it was filled with caramel or caramel, tomato, tomato, if you will. 
Oh, it was so good. It's one thing we never have to worry about in this house ever, honey, is uh, chocolate expiring or any sort of sweet going bad. Not gonna happen over here. Gosh, another new thing that we've been doing. Uh, change is all up in her! We actually, um, before this week, we would always watch a lot of, like, shows on TV, even though we don't even have TV or we don't have cable. We would always watch, like, Netflix or something, and in this, in this, this week we've actually dumbed it down to, like, one show, one watching a week, and it's been doing, it's been pretty well. We, uh, watched our one show today, um, it was Malcolm in the Middle. Definitely one of my favorite shows. But yeah, it's it's nice because you know, spending more time together. It's a good thing, you know? Spending time together isn't isn't sitting on the couch and watching TV. You know, you know, having a good dinner with your family isn't sitting at the dinner table and watching TV. It's you know, quality time together. And that's something that this girl is teaching me. Oh, you're such a sweetheart! Making me a better person. <laughs>